Hey, how you doing? Professor Hiccup here. Uh, today we're going to do a music reaction video. We're going to do it to... I forgot. We're going to do it to... Uh... Oh yeah, Led Zeppelin. It's a Led Zeppelin tribute featuring the Foo Fighters, Kid Rock, and Lenny Kravitz at the 2012 Kennedy Center Honors. Now, that was quite a while ago, 10 years ago, 9 years ago. Uh, I might have seen this. I don't remember seeing this. Um, but either way, I'm, I'm sure it's going to be enjoyable. Uh, now the Foo Fighters, I'm not really super familiar with them. I know it's David Grohl. I know David Grohl's stuff. I've seen him, you know, in some other projects too. And, uh, you know, I know Foo Fighters is basically Nirvana after, um, Kurt Cobain died. David Grohl started this group, uh, Kid Rock. I've seen many times. I know a lot of his earlier stuff and Lenny Kravitz is just uh, a rock God. I've also seen him before. I uh, just absolutely love everything Lenny does. Uh, so I don't know if they're all doing this together or if it's just like uh, each one sings a little bit here or there or whatever. Don't know, but we'll find out. Uh, so let's jump into this. This is a Led Zeppelin tribute uh, at the 2012 Kennedy Center Honors. And before we get into this, though, if by chance you have not subscribed to this channel yet, feel free and subscribe to the channel. Uh, speaking of free, it is free to subscribe to this channel or any channel for that fact. Uh, and not only is it free, but it's good for your health, it's good for the environment, and it's kitten approved. So I'm just saying, it's a win-win for everyone. All right, so let's jump into this video, uh, Led Zeppelin Tribute, 2012, at the Kennedy Center Honors. Ladies and gentlemen, Foo Fighters. Rock and roll. Okay, uh, so far, well, David Grohl's the drummer, uh, and this is definitely a drumming song, uh, so he's doing fantastic. Um, I don't know who the other band members are. I think that one guy next to the singer is in Foo Fighters, but I don't know who the other two guys are, um, and I don't know the singer. Uh, he's doing an okay job. Musically, it's fantastic, uh, but he's not really giving the song justice. He's giving his own sound, which is fantastic, but being that, you know, they're at the... Let, Zeppelin tribute, which obviously they're going to be in front of Jimmy Page and Robert Plant and uh, the other gentleman. Um, can't remember his name right off. Wow. Um, you know, obviously you want to give a top notch performance. And his is a little bit lackluster. He's got a great voice, and for his own interpretation, it's fantastic. But for where they are, it should be slightly a, a step above it. Not only are you playing in front of Led Zeppelin, who are like the granddaddies of rock and roll music, uh, they've they've contributed more to, to to this type of rock than most any other band. Uh, but they're playing in front of the president president of the United States and his wife. This is pressure, and a, an audience full of celebrities. Time. 
Okay, like I said, you know, the lead singer didn't give a lot to this song, uh, but rock and roll is definitely a drumming song, so this is mostly about David Grohl, and he did his 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 damnedest at it. He played the hell out of this song. Oh, that's David Grohl for you. He's a fantastic musician, anyhow. Uh, so I'm guessing next is going to be Kid Rock. Uh, Kid Rock, I've always loved Kid Rock, uh, but he started off as a rapper, uh, and then he went into like a rap rock sound. They went into a rock country rap sound. They went to a country rap sound. So he's been all over the place. Um, you know, he's always got great musicians around him, uh, but his voice isn't always the greatest. He's got, a, I mean, I enjoy his voice. Uh, and, and I actually like the tone of his voice. I like a lot of his songs, uh, but he doesn't have a lot of range with it. Uh, so let's see what he's going to do and, and uh, see what song he's going to cover. Thank you, Robert. Ladies and gentlemen, Kid Rock. Gave him gonna leave you. We sent up for that. I gotta say, whoever put this together, this this uh, a tribute, picked the perfect song for Kid Rock, Kid Rock's voice. Uh, like I said in the beginning, he doesn't have the greatest voice. Uh, definitely not a Robert Plant style voice, and uh, this was the perfect choice for Kid Rock, in my opinion. But now it's time for me to go The autumn moon lights my way And I smell the rain And with it pain And it's headed my way Oh, sometimes I grow so tired But you know I've got Now these two are bopping their heads, and uh, and uh, Robert's just sitting there, going, "Hmm, is it possible Robert's not enjoying it?" And there's David Letterman that didn't catch in there yet, and he's he's loving it. Uh, but yeah, the, what is that look on Robert Plant or Robert? Yeah, Robert Plant's face. <laughs> It was very nice. A, a Kid Rock obviously knew his, his voice limitations, and and he did perfect for that song. Uh, you know, and and for him to uh, attempt to do a Robert Plant wasn't smart, so he decided not to, and he kept it in his own limits, and ended up being absolutely awesome, in my opinion. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, Lenny Kravitz. Now, absolutely love Lenny Kravitz. He's doing a whole lot of love. That's probably the best song they could have picked for him. Lenny Kravitz, in my opinion, is the epitome of what a rock star should be. He's got the look. He's got the rock and roll voice. He can play any instrument. Uh, the, the guy is just a major, major talent. And to give him a whole lot of love, yeah, good choice, I bet. Lenny Kravitz.
I was just thinking, not only, you know, he's got to do, he's got to sing this in front of uh, Led Zeppelin. He's got to sing this in front of the President of the United States and his wife. He's got a ton of celebrities in the audience, like uh, I saw Yo-Yo Ma there, Bonnie Raitt, uh, Jimmy Kimball, just a whole bunch of people. But they also got a massive TV audience. And all three of these musicians so far have just come out and they just do it. It's like, I, I don't under, I would have such bad stage fright, but that's a whole different story. All right, let's get into Lenny Kravitz doing the whole lot of love. Robert Plant setting up, getting ready for the, the jam part. I don't know why that doesn't always work. Let's try that again. Gave the smile of approval there. Yeah, he killed it. Mm. Oh. Okay, that was awesome. Uh, that was the, I don't know how we got into this, uh, but the Kennedy Kennedy uh, Center Honors 2012 for uh, Led Zeppelin uh, with Foo Fighters, Kid Rock, and Lenny Kravitz. And, uh, you know, at the end, Lenny, uh, you know, closed the show and took down the house. Uh, that whole thing was fantastic. I really enjoyed that. I, I really don't remember seeing that. Uh, um, I figured I probably did see it at some point, but I, I don't remember seeing it. Uh, fantastic. And uh, time to get into the next video. Uh, any uh, requests you have, don't forget to put them down below. But for right now, that's a wrap.